<laughs> about your def- defensive rookie of the year? Ooh, my defensive rookie of the year, I think it's only one person, honestly. Michael Parsons. This guy, listen, man, just, I, you know what excites me about guys is motors. I love a motor, right? And when you watch Michael Parsons on the Dallas Cowboys, it's a difference maker. He's, he's, he flashes when everybody else's number is not flashing. When you go watch football, when you, when you go watch film, you're like, who is that? Who is that? That's Michael Parsons. And I'm telling you, he'll probably win rookie of the year as defensive rookie of the year for sure. Yeah, he, I agree. I agree. I think that thing's done right now. And you can put his hand on the ground and rush the pass. And we saw that early in the season. Not many guys can yeah, do that. And he it. can cover a ton of ground. Yeah. That's crazy to think because I think he mentioned in the season that he had never put his hand in the ground, as you mentioned, since high school. But we've seen him get after the quarterback. Have we ever seen anything like that? I don't know if we have. I'm, I'm trying to think when, when, did we, when, when, when did we see something like that, mm-hmm. right? Oh, I, I got to go all the we've way back. We've seen guys – convert from down players to up players. Up like, players. Like Billy Ray Smith did. Remember but not the opposite. No, no. To go down, right. it's hard to, to do. Down. To go yeah. down, it's hard, hard to, do. to do. That's a hard thing to do. But I'm going with Michael Parsons for my rookie of the year. All right, rookie of the year. And then possibly we could see him defensive player of the year. But how about your defensive player of the year right now? <laughs> it's a lot of pressure going on right now. <laughs> my defensive player of the year right now, seriously, probably Miles Garrett. I, it, it's... Cleveland is not the same team, not just defense, not just the same team without Miles Garrett. You take Miles Garrett off of Cleveland's team, you're, you're asking a question, what's next? I think Miles Garrett, and if he finished the year the way I think he's going to finish, they got some big games coming up late in the season. Yeah. And if he does what he's supposed to do, and the Browns have to complete what they have to complete as well, I think Miles Garrett has a great chance to win defense player of the year. By the way, as, as one of the voters for that award, I'm going to act like Brady Quinn does when he's covering a game. I can't pick that. No, I'm picking <laughs> I pick Miles Garrett right now. <laughs> I pick my vote right now, and I do have a vote. I will Right now, if I had the vote, I would yeah. pick Miles Garrett. Yeah, for sure. Miles Garrett, of course, an X Factor. The Browns just 5-5 five and five this year, but if we're talking about getting into the postseason, he could be that guy that helps that side of the ball. Yeah and the team as a whole there. Of course, Ray, Ray, you're going to be busy with us here, the CBS family, a little bit. I am. Um, the Art of the Under, it, that, that listen a little, sounds a little more defensive-minded there, but tell us about that. Uh, what's that going to entail for CBS Sports HQ? Honestly, man, I think it's a, it's a real under-the-hood look at what I truly believe we have to get back to to understand defense again, right? The Art of the Under is really understanding what does it mean to play together, what does it mean to have pure communication on defense? And you know, when you watch all of these points being scored, Pete, the, if you're sitting, if you're me sitting at home, you're like, what? What has happened to football? <laughs> right? According, you know, with the rules and everything, you can't hit nobody. You can't touch the quarterback. You can't do this. But I want to break down the art of the under is to break down what makes defenses great. And when they do break down, what are the real problems? You know, a lot of people commentating and be like, well, they was in a cover three and he shouldn't have done this. No, 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 no. It starts way before that. And that's what the art of the under is. We're going to go up under the hood and find out what makes defenses Can't really wait great. to see it. Yeah. Can't wait to see it. All right. We can't wait to see it's gonna it. It's going to be amazing. As always. Appreciate it. Ray Lewis checking in here at CBS Sports HQ. Thanks for hanging out with us. Let's do this next week. We can do this. Pete, oh, yeah. oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We Ray, can do good? this next week. Okay. It's always good to have two Hall of Famers here. <laughs> as always. Thanks, my friend. Where's Absolutely, the other one? my friend. <laughs> right there. <laughs> Not yet. <laughs> Do you want a sports network that delivers everything that matters about the game? The highlights, the picks, the instant analysis, no yelling, no fake debates, no politics. Hit the subscribe button and never miss a moment.